Welcome back to another reaction video and I'm very, very happy today because Maximum the Hormone is back in my life. I usually do a video for them every Sunday, but I missed last week. Um, there was a few reasons why um, I didn't get a chance to record a video for that one. So I had to use some other videos in its place, but I am back this week with uh, Zetsubo Billy. This is an old one from 2007. I've been meaning to check out some of the earlier stuff. Although having said that, um, Coin Omega Lover was actually from this album as well, I believe. Uh, Van Man Talks, once again, uh, he sent me this link. This is an unlisted one. It is difficult finding some of the videos for some of these songs, but um, yeah, here we go. We've got, uh, we've got an older video. Anyway, let's not muck about today. Let us don the headphones of Juge May. Let us enter the screen. Oh, full. Let's press play. Okay, straight away, I've noticed this with a few of the videos, as soon as I would start watching it, it's like, is this the right video? But I, I have faith that I've been sent the right video. Let's just take this one right the way back, and we'll start again. Have faith. So first impressions, first of all, this one, again, this was 2007, so an earlier song. Very strong system of a down vibes in terms of the riff. Not nothing else, just that, that riff has got a very kind of, um, reminds me very much of the guitar tones from their debut album, uh, System's debut album. Of course, you've got the video going here. I don't know if they're taking the piss out of sort of genres that were going on at the time. I think this might have had something to do with the Death Note um, uh, anime is it anime or manga manga might be manga how many times can i say manga i was kind of doubting at first whether it it, it does have that um obviously you never know with maximum of the hormone because the, their styles change so much but as soon as uh, daisuke came in there with his his unmistakable vocals in there that was just like oh no yeah this is maximum the hormone but let's carry on Sorry, one more thing. Uh, the production sounds a lot more raw on this one as well. You can tell it's kind of an earlier recording from them. You know, it's like some some of the latest stuff sounds a lot more polished, a lot more uh, a lot more beefy. This still sounds real heavy, but it's got that kind of yeah, that more sort of raw punk sort of feel to it. Which is good. before we change another thing i've noticed um the similar to coin omega lover you've got that more sort of poppy kind of chorus going on in there as well which ain't no bad thing
Um, I'll take that back a bit. So much to enjoy there. Now, really, I, I, I noticed I, uh, her drumming seems a lot more fierce actually on this song. I've noticed there's a few points of this where I've really, really noticed her hammering it down. Real, just the consummate front man. He's just, he's just great. I absolutely love him, man. He's, uh, he's just awesome. As I've already mentioned, Daisuke. When he goes from that, it's his, it's his fry vocal that I really enjoy. It's very distinctive and it's very passionate and it's very, it's just got, it's full of energy. You know what I mean? It's full of power to me. I, I just absolutely love it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then of course you got Uwe Chan on the bass. Uh, really, really nice bass line. Let's just listen to this bass line again here actually. When he, when he changes from this vocal into the fry, I like this. Cool, cool, cool. What can I say, man? I just love Maximum the Hormone. Let's see if we can get uh, some lyrics for this son bitch. Billy in Despair, apparently it stands for. This page of everlasting depression, fleeting tactics in those eyes, without in treatment, an evil act tied to prison. Poisoned by a night book, a uh, notebook, nope, eh. Uh, poisoned by a notebook, grasping onto fear from earthly desires, incessantly drooling from the delusion of giant lies. Oh dear. Does this have anything to do with um, Death Note? Is this to do with Death Note or is this just a song that ended up on the, you know, did they write it specifically for Death Note or did it, uh, or was it just sort of picked for the soundtrack? Fragments from the hammer of an evil mind robbing one of life, saturated with criminals, the urgent murder of a sinner. Because I've, I've not seen Death Note, but I kind of got the, uh, I, I kind of get the idea of it, I think. I think somebody, I think somebody summons a demon. I think, it, I, I seem to remember something that whoever, whoever, whoever's name he wrote in a book, that person would get killed. Hence, death note. I think, I think that's what it was. So I'm wondering if this has to do with, yeah, so from the, from the guy who's writing the, uh, the name, the urgent murder of a sinner, you know, is it, is it him? Uh, so well, I believe this this person is bad, and therefore they need to go or whatever. Maybe I'm I can I I wouldn't be surprised if I'm completely getting that wrong. Above us is the battle site of a dark funeral. Truth, peace, negotiations, erroneous regret for many a long year. Pity. Above us in the battle site of a dark funeral. Oh, it's the same one again. Just repeating myself. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. See, I. I always get confused with lyrics when I uh, am I trying to put something on to the lyrics that isn't actually part of it. So yeah, let me know. Is that is that to do with Death Note or is it nothing to do with Death Note? Either way, song, banging, love it. They've not let me down yet. Uh, there was another. There's another early one that I keep getting requests for as well. What's up, people? I think um, I think that's another one that keeps getting huge amounts of requests. Um, yeah. Pretty sure it's what's up, people. 
Death Note opening too. So that's definitely from Death Note. Def that's definitely from Death Note. Zetsubo Billy is the second ending theme of the Death Note anime series performed by Maximum the Hormone. So it definitely was, it definitely was on the, uh, on the soundtrack but yeah whether it's written for it or not i don't know but uh yeah i might uh, well be um making up things for the lyrics then that uh, don't actually apply but uh i'm just scrolling through now what am i doing maybe the next one will be what's up people that uh that could well be the one to go for next and uh that'd be yeah that'd make sense as well that's two death note songs then and uh some older stuff covered excellent that's what I'm going to do next. What's up, people? Yeah. So, thank you very much. And I will be back next week with more Maximum the Hormone. I will be back next week this time. And, uh, yeah. Brain gone. Things. Mind. Thoughts. What? Uh? I'll see you later. Ooh.